At a news conference today, our Paula Reed asked Attorney General Jeff Sessions about his department's civil rights priorities. Her question seemed to touch a nerve. Paula, what happened? Anthony, I tried to ask Attorney General Jeff Sessions about the Justice Department's investigation into Harvard University's use of race in admissions. At issue is whether the elite school discriminates against Asian American students by holding them to a higher standard than other applicants. Letters we have obtained show civil rights division investigators have concluded the school is out of compliance with federal law. Now, former justice officials tell me this kind of investigation is unprecedented. The letters also indicate Harvard is refusing to hand over documents and has gone so far as to challenge the department's authority to investigate. The Justice Department has threatened to sue the university if it does not cooperate. Now, none of this should have come as a surprise to the attorney general or his staff, but when I brought it up, here's what happened. Uh, Mr. Attorney General, uh, your civil rights department, for the most part, uh, has not done many investigations into systemic racial discrimination, but you are currently this investigating. On yeah. this, this is the Attorney General of the United States. I understand you're doing your job, but I'm doing mine too. Your, your civil rights division is investigating Harvard University for possible civil rights violations related to affirmative action, possibly discriminating against Asian Americans and white students. Why is this a priority? for your Justice Department. Okay, we'll take an on-topic question on opioids. Why, right. can he, why can't he answer that, though? I mean, this is a conversation about our opioid policies. He was able to ask about Alabama. He was able to ask about sanctuary cities. Why can't I ask about this? Justice Department reporters, we regularly ask about ongoing investigations, and Mr. Sessions' staff routinely declines to comment. But not allowing the attorney general to deal with the direct question in an open press conference is, to say the least, unusual, Anthony. A very persistent Paula Reed with a very silent attorney general. Thank you.